what you're going to see here is a 15 second clip or so that's been explained out over another 16 minutes and then some filler information for what is this regarding. This explains to you a new way of looking at things that are everywhere and date back to the beginning of film and its commercial distribution. This right here is an example of the leadership of the people of Cobra. Anywhere where they're 
the shifty goats. So until recently, you know. So so what I'm saying is, is that um, these people um, uh, uh, could only enforce one particular law, and that would be to require fire extinguishers. So you didn't have any boat fires, and require dredging, salvaging. Like that. So that's the only thing that's really reasonable in that area. Okay, so not having fire extinguishers, probably a rule for the Suez Canal uh, uh, or, or something like that, or registration with certain countries. So, uh, you know, you cause fire extinguishers to go missing or something like that, and then you uh, uh, report a boat for being whatever suspicious as terrorists or whatever, and then immediately uh, anybody who's close or whatever, uh, militarily or law enforcement-wise, anywhere is going to hammer down on any location. This has been programmed into law enforcement at the local level worldwide. Um, there is not one zip code that will not report a terrorist attack higher up to somebody who knows more about it than they do. Alright? There's not one law enforcement person that would not immediately go to a higher form of government that knows more about it than what they know. Right? So anyway, the point is, is that uh, all governments and all law enforcement are all predictable and so therefore uh, somebody caused fire extinguishers on that boat near the Suez Canal to get derelicted, and some guy ended up uh, stuck on there for a couple of years. Um, and uh, uh, obviously, it was a criminal attempt to get a boat stuck. Instead, that ship just got uh, derelicted, and a bunch of people, you know, ruined their life, lost their livelihoods. That's the short version. Anyway, um, so this is.
this does something.
understand that there could be a bunch of different people working on the same thing and not even know. So therefore you need somebody to get into somebody's mind and a detector in order to be able to keep anything like this from ever happening. Then again, what if you're only looking for one thing placed at a specific time and it was going to happen? Like me, observing this, recording this, making an example of the level of things that people uh, need to be able to figure out in order to run a country. You have to be able to figure this kind of shit out. Easy. You have to also, you have to know first that you can do anything like this. This is old, old, old strategy. This is like 1940s, 50s level strategy. It's just like a lot nicer and it doesn't involve like destruction of white tapes being started and stopped by right here or some film or anything. Because you know you got the digital you just start and stop. Your only issue is buffering if you want to monitor somebody looking at specific things online. Like this one definitely is. The question is whether somebody's doing anything with it because nobody reasonable is running the government. Savage on best. Anyway, now that um, this is 15 minutes and I have thoroughly explained this, um, uh, people should understand uh, this is telling these people about what this is. Okay? This is an event that's occurring. Uh, if you go past the event, you, it will have no relevance. Except for the fact that if somebody can go back and say, oh yeah, no, this was happening, you know, then you gotta know that somebody can be looking at something like this. Anyway, there's also a video called The Last Action Hero. The Last Mercenary just got my attention because same kind of thing, cool action hero, uh, another, another main character looks kind of like me, uh, which is pretty neat, but whatever. Um, uh, and the backstory is exactly what's going on right in front now. So, uh, Duke should be showing up. That's usually what happens. Uh, uh, then he's like, you know, Joe, and then I go under soul. Well, Duke, it really is just like yours, but it's more evil because it's a cheap copy and does magic shit. Anyway, it's time. To launch G.I. Joe. Left, right, left, out to right. Left, right, left, the battle wages on for toy soldiers. 